Hello, in this tutorial I will demonstrate how to make your way through our online program. By the end of this video you should be familiar with starting the course, going through our tutorial videos and questions, as well as how to submit a project, and finally viewing our content and activities. So go ahead, log into your CoAssemble account. This should take you to the Your Courses page where you have a to-do access where we have given you access to our activities, go ahead and start course. This will take you to the overview as well as what you will learn. Go ahead and download the Scratch program if you haven't done so. This is the overview of the activities that you'll be doing in this particular course. And then go ahead click start course. This will take you to the terms and conditions. We recommend that you read through this before you start on any of our courses. Go ahead and click next module. Agree to our terms and conditions by clicking yes. Next, and then again, next module. This will take you to a video tutorial that you can watch. Once you've done that, you'll head to a question that will relate to that video. That you will need to answer. Then there will be several of those. There will be quizzes that will tell you, will ask you certain questions that relate to the overview of all of um, the foundational activities or that particular course. So go ahead and answer those questions and you do need to answer all of them before you can go ahead. And then we have the project submission where you would have created a project on Scratch software. So go ahead, answer the questions, and then you would need to upload that project. And as you can see, I've created a project on Scratch. I will go to File, save it to my computer. Make sure to put a name for it. In this sense, I will do demonstration project. Go ahead and name it whatever you like. So I'm going to save, head back to the online program, drop or click to upload that file that I've created. So demonstration project one, open, it's uploaded. I go ahead and submit the answer. You can save it as a draft if you do want to make changes in the future. That's up to you. And then submit again, read through the instructions, submit and then you can head to the next module where you will have access to our foundational activities or whatever course you have you will have access to that content or activities that we have provided if you are a teacher you will have access to this content if you are a student you will not have access to this content you will only have access to the foundational activities for scratch quizzes and tutorial videos as well as the project submission I hope this has helped you in understanding how to go through our online program. See you next time. Thank you.